Hello, gamer no is back. And in this video, we're going to help this noob with the rework Phoenix Fruit, gain friends, grind, and become pro. But before we start, you can show your support by using star code gamer gnome when purchasing your robux 5% of the earnings will go to me and this will really help us on making better videos where the actor slam oh there it is forward there's your slam there's the dump okay so first question that my friend asked me gamer gnome is there an m1 or left click for the rework phoenix guys i tried it and it only decreased my energy wait a minute Yes guys, I tried left clicking and nothing happened. So let's just focus on the first skill, the cannon. So guys, let's try it, okay? It is a multi-target skill. The damage is decent. You need to hit the bandit three times to defeat it. Oh wait, we don't have a quest. <laughs> there you go. And once you level up, put all your stats on the black fruits. That's 12. And you only need to hit it twice to defeat a bandit. Okay, target level here, gamer gnome. Level 15. And also the return of this stat check. Melee is 10, Black Fruits 34. For the next skill, we got the F skill, the hybrid at Mastery 30. And the other skill is at Mastery 90, the Regeneration Flames. The best way to gain that mastery is head to the Fountain City. And guys, I will make things fast and unlock those two skills in just two minutes, okay? <laughs> so make sure to listen and follow. So let's start the timer. First, you need to lure the Galley Pirate. You're gonna use your Z skill, dodge to the side to dodge his skill, and use your M1 to damage him. Okay, so again, you just need to repeat that until you defeat the Galley Pirate. You will gain lots and lots of masteries here until you reach level 55. So here are the stats, 15 mil defense, blood fruits 135, and also this is the hybrid flight. There you go, next island is the Pirate Village. Our target here is Bobby the Clown. Okay, so he is a boss here. So to defeat him, Z skill. Same with the guy pirate. Dodge to the side. Use your Z skill here. You won't be using your M1. Left clicks. There you go. Take note, you only need to defeat him twice to reach level 60. Next up is the desert. So here we have two mobs to defeat. First the desert bandits. Guys, we only have the cannon for damage. So guys, be patient. Keep on grinding until level 75. Next up, desert officers. Same strategy, guys. Okay? So we're gonna live here at level 90. Stat check. Melee, 35. Defense, 20. Blast fruits, 215. Next island is the frozen village. Guys, don't forget to buy the sky jump enhancement and the flash step. So we're gonna go straight to the snow bandits. Let's check the time. 1 minute and 12 seconds, we still have 1 minute to go, so keep on grinding here until you reach level 105. Now, time to defeat the Yeti. So you need 10 Z skills. Yes guys, you can count it. It's a total of 10 to defeat the Yeti. Guys, you're gonna do server hop until you reach level 130. And after that, 30 seconds to go guys. <laughs> Stat check first. 40 million defense. 310 blocks fruits. So guys, next up, Marine Fortress. Don't forget to buy the black cape for I think 50 or 60,000. This cape increases your damage, your HP, and some of your energy, okay? So our target is the Vice Admiral. So guys, finally, in this area, we will unlock our X skill. So congratulations to us. But the question is, Gamer Gnome, will this help us grind the regeneration flames? Guys, we are about to find out. So here we go, two minutes. Here is the regeneration flame, so this skill heals everyone around it, including us. So can it damage? Let's try it, guys. Boom. Guys, it doesn't damage. Waste of time. No! No! Guys, I'm telling you, it's very hard to grind with this fruit. But don't worry, things will be faster when we unlock the fast kick at Mastery 60. Check it out, 11 Masteries to go. So for our next training area is the prison. Guys, always be vigilant because this area has lots of server hoppers. For example, this one. Lightfoot user, there you go. And I don't know if that is a death step or a dark step. Hello bro, I mean you no harm. <laughs> there are three bosses here, the Warden, Chief Warden, and the Swan. Guys, they're very easy to defeat. You just need to do wall strap. Meaning just door, hit the wall, there you go, and defeat him. Same with the Chief Warden, you can defeat him with a wall strat. And if you are having a hard time with the Swan, look for a friend. Apple. Yeah. Let's strike him here, but kill me first. Okay. And by the way, guys, we already unlocked the fast kick, so we're gonna try it. Here it is. There you go, guys. Not bad for the damage. And also, the cooldown is really fast. So I decided not to kill him and just heal him. And prepare ourselves to defeat the swan. Okay, is that a better idea? I think it is. 
So here we go. You guys, I think it will be easy for us to defeat him, but my friend made a mistake. He tried to use left clicks on the swan. I tried to heal him, but to no avail. There you go, he died. I will avenge you, my friend. Okay, so thanks. And he asked us to help him defeat the Chief Warden. So, whoa, 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 whoa. Guys, I don't know why we did not add each other's allies. But still, we help each other in defeating it. And that's the most important thing. By the way, our target level here is 350. So for the stats, Blocks Fruits 820, melee defense 115. Next up, the Magma Village. Our target here is the Magma Admiral. Now I can show you the Fast Kick. Here's the Fast Kick, there you go. Again, the good thing here is the cooldown, it's really fast. So combo it with the cannon and after that, make sure to dodge his attacks. And then use your Fast Kick, okay? Fast Kick Cannon, Fast Kick Cannon, and that's it. Wait Gamer now, what if I get hit? Guys, don't worry, did you forget the regeneration flames? So just use your exit skill and run to the side so that you can dodge his skills while healing, okay? Okay, so we're gonna do server hop here until we reach level 425. And I know your question, Gamer Nom, are we going to unlock the final skill, the full transformation? Yes, the answer is yes. So let's head to the next island, the underwater city and defeat the Fishman Lord. So guys, I will be quick here. Just lure him. Again, wall strap. Same with the Warden, Chief Warden, and also the Swan, and that's it. There you go. You're just gonna keep on grinding here. Serve up until level 500. After that, moving on. Two more mobs to go. Next up is the Skyland. So here, we're gonna defeat the Whisper only. Yes, Whisper only. So how do you do that? Guys, very easy. Again, the Stone Strat. Just go on top of the stone. Use your skills. Wait for him to use his cannon. There you go. Oh, sorry, Bazooka. He cannot hit you here, guys. He will only hit the rock. And that's it. Just keep on grinding. Server hop until you reach level 625. That check. Melee defense 165. Block fruits 1545. Final island is the Fountain City. So here, guys, our last and only target is the Gali Pirates. So you only need to defeat 4 at a time, do this twice to level up, and finally we will unlock the full transformation. So here it is, there you go. First thing that you should know, it will decrease your energy every time you are transformed. Here is the full transformation Z skill, multi-target, there you go. So next up is the fast kick. Guys, I think you can only target 2 enemies with the fast kick. And last but not the least, the regeneration flames. Guys, I'm not sure if this skill can damage the enemies. If you know, please comment it on the comment section. And you're gonna reach level 700 here. Okay, guys, so I think that's it for this video. I hope that you enjoyed. Again, to all the viewers, subscribers, supporters, I really appreciate you all. This is GamerNom and GamerNom out.